Louisiana Beer Reviews, NOLA Brewings, Irish Channel Stout, New Orleans Lager and Ale Company on Chapatula Street in New Orleans, Louisiana. This beer has been out since 2010, but it was recently released in cans late 2013, early 2014. $8.79 for a four pack. Okay, 6.8% alcohol. This is, uh, it's finished with a touch of Baker's chocolate. Okay. I've never had it. We just got it here in the store in the past week. Uh, it gets an outstanding score on Beer Advocate with 68 ratings and 88 out of 100 on Great Beer, 84 out of 100 for the style with only 25 ratings. So less than 100 ratings. And it gets an outstanding score on the Beer and Meat. All right, I was excited when it arrived. I never had a chance to try it on draft, and I figured I would check out the can. Plus, I keep the can for my can collection. I keep all the Louisiana, something from each Louisiana brewer. So here we are at the third supermarket, Riverland Shopping Center, Laplace, Louisiana. Let's take a little taste of this. I'm very excited to try it. When the, when the delivery man came into the store, he said, I got something brand new. And I thought he was pulling my leg. I said, oh, don't tell me all that. He said, no, you're gonna, he said, I do. And he showed it to me. I said, oh no. All right, um, not much of a head, very thin beige collar of foam and a very dark brown, almost black appearance, but there is some, lighter brown when the light comes around the edges. I don't see any bubbles. There may be there may be bubbles, but it's too dark. I can't tell. Let's go with the aroma. It's a uh, dark roasted barley malt. Maybe some coffee. Maybe the baker's chocolate. That could be, I'd like to know what brand of Baker's chocolate would be interesting to know. But it's a kind of a full aroma. It smells nice, but it's 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 subtle in a way. It's hard hard to say. It's not like over overpowering. I think if it warmed up it would come out more. Let's go with the um, flavor. Okay, dark roast and barley malt, of course. Creaminess, astringency, some uh, uh, acidity, a lot of bitterness. I don't know what the IBUs are, but it's quite a bit of bitterness there. Some blackened, you know, char, charcoal. A little bit of back, a little chocolate background, I would say. Some creaminess. A little bit of creaminess. Yeah, but it tastes like a like a stout. They all are very similar. Uh, you know, a regular stout's not an imperial stout. Um, the mouthfeel is medium. There's a little prickliness on the tongue. That's why I'm thinking there must have been some bubble screams that I could not see. finish is dry, pretty dry. It's, the drinkability is pretty good here at 6.40 in the morning, close to 6.45 a.m. Uh, it's good, it's really, it's really good, it's delicious. Uh, It's definitely worth two twenty a can. Twenty cents a can. I would definitely nice little lacing here. I would definitely recommend it if you see it. 
I think you should buy it and try it. Uh, just to show you a few other stouts that they carry here at the Therns Supermarket, I was looking around. Uh, of course, we got the Irish Channel Stout. The reason they call it the Irish Channel Stout is because that's the neighborhood in New Orleans, the Irish Channel. Down by the river where the brewery is. Uh, weeks ago they got the St. Ambroise Oatmeal Stout. This is another one to try. It's 5% so it's very mild, but I would highly recommend that. You could come in here and buy that. It's a 96 out of 100. Here I have a kid. Oh, I'm sorry, that's... I'm looking at the old Rasputin. Well, there's another one. That, and they don't even have any more. That stuff sells so fast. Um, the wonderful Lion Stout from Sri Lanka. Don't pass this up. Don't pass this up. Uh, George Killian's uh, Irish Stout from Coors. Really good one. Really good. Um, they did a great job with this. Coming in by that. <clears throat> and some other ones. So, and let, I, I, I have to show you this one. I must. And this one. Oh, what am I doing? A tour of the store. Young's Double Chocolate Stout. Got to get that. And maybe the world's greatest stout, John Kirch Russian Imperial Stout. So fabulous. You need to come to Mathern's and make a stout run. I have. All right, so uh, one more sip. This is a solid A. Solid A, most excellent, great beer beer advocate, can have it right with this one. So, Les Les Bon Temps Roulé, the most excellent beer, Nola's Irish Channel Stout, Irish Channel Stout. Now, I'm going to end this review by saying y'all come on down to Matherns and check out their wonderful and varied beer selection.